In September of 2010, the Wellbeing MD Center for Life was created as an extension of our integrative lifestyle and functional medicine based practice. Within its confines, real life changing medicine is offered to all who participate. As one of the first teaching kitchens built in a physician's office, the Mindful Kitchen has reached thousands of individuals through hands on cooking classes, demonstrations, and our popular Palos Heights Cable Cooking Show. This multi purpose teaching facility equips the practicing physician with food, movement, and mindful living as new prescriptions for 21st century medicine. Over 1,000 people have gotten on our roadmap to wellness and transformed their own lives through eating well, moving with enjoyment, and developing a resilience to stress. Functional fitness, yoga, tai chi, qigong, meditation, melt, and ageless grace to promote brain health are the basis of their continuing wellness education programs. It is said that we need less tech and more touch in medicine. Our chiropractic care, massage therapy, acupuncture, and acupressure treatments help integrate the body to allow maximal benefits of all that we nourish ourselves with. The currency of wellness is community. Wellbeing MD is committed to putting the we in wellness. We are honored and often humbled by what this work has accomplished. The transformed lives tell the real story of why this center embraces life. They echo the Epicurean reminder, not what we have, but what we enjoy constitutes our abundance. We are grateful for the continued opportunity to serve and move medicine to where it belongs. Their stories tell our story. Hi, I'm Pat Bailey and I'm the uh, Outreach Coordinator at Wellbeing MD and all of us are here tonight to celebrate the five years of Wellbeing MD Center for Life. Uh, just a little background on myself, I met Dr. Principe at the Palos Park Library when he was uh, educating people about different supplements and that's when I learned about, I thought, what's with this guy? He's into real natural stuff. He was talking about vitamin D3. And I had several older women I knew that were taking lots of vitamin D. After that, I met him at the Palisites Women's Club meeting, and he talked me and four other women into taking his road to wellness class. That's the class that changed my life in the spring of 2011. How about you guys? How did he change your life? I took his class, well I'm, I was a patient of his, so that's how, I'm, how, how I've known him. And I also took that roadmap to wellness class, I took one and then I took a refresher too, a couple of years later. Um, I, it did change my life, like you said Pat, it, was a, it is life changing, it makes you aware of the health that you can have if you try hard and put some effort into it. Uh, and, and the reason that health is so important and, how, and the role you play in your own health and you need to be a contributing factor to that because diseases hold disease at bay. Um, there's diabetes in my family, so every year I have my annual physical. I hope I don't get that diagnosis. And one of the ways not to is to move more, eat healthy, and... Uh, do everything that Dr. Principe says to do, and he is your cheerleader, Yes. and he's a great cheerleader, yes. and he genuinely cares for people. You can feel it. You you feel like you'll let him down and yourself down if you don't keep up with <laughs> a lot of the things that he has taught you, from how good vegetables can taste, uh, zucchini and, and squash, butternut squash, everything that he he has um, created in this kitchen, and he's, I've gone to a lot of his cooking classes, too. I'm Irish. I'm known not to be a great cook. Uh, he's Italian. I've learned an awful lot from him. I'm not the greatest. I never will be. It's not my specialty, but uh, 
if you're not crazy about vegetables, you'll find a way to eat more vegetables. Um, I, I, I can't say enough about it. it. It did change my life, gave me more energy. And when they say you want, you want to get down on the floor with your grandchildren, if you ever get grandchildren, I did. It isn't easy to get down and up, but it's easier now than it was five years ago when I, before I started the class. So he's my hero. He's my hero, and the class is very wonderful. So. What about you, Jeannie? Yeah, uh, hi, I'm Jeannie Kropowskis. I'm Executive Director for the District 230 Foundation. And I'm so excited and wish Dr. Prince Pay congratulations on his fifth anniversary being the founder of Wellbeing MD. I started uh, here with Dr. Prince Pay in 2012, and it's been a journey, it's been a process. I'm always trying to get better, and I'm so thankful uh, to know Dr. Principe and to be on this journey with him. Uh, Dr. Principe partnered with us with the foundation for our health and wellness events that we have. He was our first guest speaker, and we were so excited that he started off our health and wellness events. I love Dr. Principe's classes here. This kitchen is phenomenal, the, the work area he has, taking his cooking classes, I've learned so much and I've become healthier and better each year with the more things that I learn. It's so great to have him in our community, close by to where we live, and to have all these resources that he gives to us. It, it, I can't tell you how terrific that is. And I continue to look to, to become better and healthier the longer that I know him. Mary, do you wanna yeah. go? Um, one thing I wanted to add um, is Dr. Principe not only is he your biggest cheerleader and he teaches you everything he does not give up he especially with me um, I had an underlying condition and he just dug and dug and dug until we figured out exactly what was going on and I got my life back I'm a mother of three three young children and I didn't know if I was going to be able to see him graduate from high school because I was so sick all the time and one year ago and now I'm a totally different person, almost 30 pounds lighter, and that was just an added bonus. I got my life back. My, I have energy. I, I know I how to feed my children. I am passing now what I've learned from Dr. Principe to my children, and and so on and so on. And I just, there are no words that can describe how grateful and how happy and how, how just thankful I am that I know him and that I got that phone call to ask me to come in to make an appointment to come into the appointment with him because he's completely changed my life and I love him and I love the staff and I love everybody in the whole community everybody mm -hmm. here and John now I know John and he helps me with my meditation and it's just a fabulous wonderful place to be a part of so thank you Oh, it is a community what do you think Kathy well I met doctor in 2010 and I came to his Roadmap to Wellness class. And I was invited to it. I never even heard of him, but I was invited to it from a friend who read about it from Dee Woods oh, okay. in the there newspaper. We so we came, and I was just blown away with everything that I learned. Uh, I had no idea how terrible the food was that I was eating. <laughs> you know, and exercise. You know, it wasn't just good for the body to lose weight. To help lose weight but it was good for my mind and that wow you know that was an eye-opener so um, and I love his ongoing classes everything I learned in the first one roadmap to wellness it was like a continuation with his ongoing classes you learn something new with each one you take at least that's what I find um, and I'm amazed at how much he has grown uh, from the first roadmap to wellness class to what he has now. It's beautiful and it's wonderful and exciting to see all the people that want to be well and want to come to learn how to be healthy, you know, and beat the illnesses that are going around. Uh, and John, with what he's teaching. John, what do you do here at Wellbeing MD? Well, fortunately, I, I was looking for an MD doctor. I originally for my wife uh, mm. and uh, kind of got taken away with some of the allopathic type medicines and things that we're doing so I was looking for some of that and I was so fortunate to 
find out that there was a doctor like John Principe in the area, and people don't even realize how fortunate we are to have him here, um, that goes beyond the normal, as been told here, goes beyond uh, the normal type of medicine into mm -hmm. food as your medicine and exercise and movement. So when I, once I got my wife involved, um, I wasn't even per, you know, looking to move over yet, and uh, she she came and she she made an appointment for me, so I came in and, <laughs> and met him, and then we started taking some of the cooking classes. And he, ex he totally exceeded my expectation as far as a functional medicine doctor. Um, such a heart. And, and compassion for what he does. And it, it even blew away more for me because now I'm able to do some of my passions of teaching Qigong and Tai Chi and energy work and working with some of his clients uh, with stress management. And it's like a dream come true. So he's opened up quite a few doors for me and I'm so honored and privileged to be working with such a wonderful man. Mm -hmm. I agree. All right, we have two more people over there, Mike. Well, uh one of the things that attracted me to John principally, I was aware of his work, but I was going to see the physician that I've been going to for many, many years. Um, but I, each time I would go there, I'd have a problem, and, and the doctor would put me on, you know, another medication. You know, and, and you watch television, there's all these things about these medications and all the side effects and that. Mm -hmm. And in the back of my mind, I, I, I didn't like it. I didn't like the fact that now I'm taking this pill, now I'm taking this pill. And, you know, what, what's going to be next? I got an inhaler because you know, my asthma was coming back uh, from when I was a boy. And uh, Dr. Prince Bay has a lot of educational things that I, I think are beneficial. And the one that was beneficial for me was he, he I was taking uh, a, a statin drug. And he had a, a, an educational film here. Uh, on stands and the side effects, and it was really an eye opener because a lot of the a lot of the things that were that they were discussing, a lot of, that real people were talking about things that they had experienced with uh, memory loss and, and muscle aches and, and other things. Uh, I was experiencing all of those as well. And so I made my appointment to come and see Dr. Principe. And since then, I'm 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 off the statin drugs. I, I no longer need to take uh, the inhaler or anything for my asthma. My asthma has been relieved. Wonderful. Uh, I'm I'm coming for the for the uh, the Qigong classes that John's offering, <laughs> uh, and continuing to come to the educational film because they really really are good. Okay, so are the awesome. the nutritional classes. The nutritional classes were yes. very good, yeah. and and the people that that are involved in all of the things that Dr. Principe offers are. are they're smart. They're smart people, and I think they. One of the reasons that they are smart is because they've been getting educated through the courses, mm -hmm. the road to well, uh, the roadmap to wellness, and, and the films, and everything that Dr. Prince of Aid does for the community. Mm -hmm. Very good. Hi, I'm Tom. Um, I guess when you can truly really say that you're blessed, you, I am blessed. Mm -hmm. uh, found Dr. Prince of Aid, uh, by another friend, uh, and. Going to my former doctor, there's an underlying problem with my family and our, our bloodline with uh, certain things going on, and, and amazingly, uh, going through other doctors, Dr. Prince Bray was the first one to find it in my family for generations uh, going on, so he's got me uh, worked on that now, which is amazing, totally amazing. So doing his roadmap, learned a lot about cooking, I mean, I'm not a great cook, but I'm trying it now. <laughs> I still burn things, but uh, it's nice because I got my wife and kids now uh, on a different path. And uh, I can just truly say I, I am totally blessed by this man. Uh, his, his classes are amazing. His uh, caring, his love for his uh, patients. It's just, you just don't find that anywhere you go. Right. So thank you. Yes. Well, I think... All of us could get together and wish Wellbeing MD a happy 50th anniversary. Yes. Yes. Here, here. Cheers here. to Wellbeing Cheers. MD. Thank, Thank God Dr. for Prince you, Dr. Thank you. Thank you. We love you so much, Doc. Appreciate it.